pag-cooperative. Ngayon po, kung um, sino po yung um, nakaka-represent, hindi po kailangan lahat po are represented. Number two po is to the uh, repeal of the Board of Directors as a layer of governance of the Council. Um, in the old ordinance, dalawang layer po siya. May Board of Directors, tapos may Executive Committee. So, medyo redundant po na dalawa because our Execom is actually yun na yung pinaka-board. And sila na din po yung may mga um, uh, positions as a Council. Um, furthermore, yung term din po nila, kasi may rule po dati so, sa ordinance na yung top five na may elect sila yung two, ter, two years, tapos yung bottom five, one year lang. So, ginawa namin, sinandardize po namin na uh, two years with a maximum of two terms. Another one is yung removal of the powers and functions of the council to undertake any fundraising and or income generating activities except for donations, benefits and grants from any person, including allocations um, that may come from LGU. So, um, usually po kasi yung mga ibang council, or actually mga ibang region, yung regional council, may mga cooperative activities po kasi na china-charge yung mga co-ops when they attend activities. So, um, hindi po natin uh, ano yun eh. Number, the other salient point is an inclusion or recognition of virtual meetings as official. Given that na, na, nakapagdaan na po tayo sa pandemic, naging uso na po yung online meeting, uh, para lang din po hindi po ma-waste yung time ng mga ibang members. Pag may mga meeting na ipapatawag, pwede po online din. And another one is making mayor as the City Development Council, um, Cooperative Council Chairperson, Co-Chairperson, in lieu of a CDA representative. So, ang sabi po ni CDA, the new guidelines, um, nagsabi is no CDA representative shall be elected to any position in the council. And yung another point is yung proposed retention of the provision in section 10, um, providing honorarium to the officers. Ang sabi po ni budget, babalikan po, um, pass this resolution on third and final reading. Correct? But yes. we had to uh, file another measure to amend to this resolution just because we needed to correct the name uh, of, the of the corporation which was um, written in the evaluation. Well, yes, Madam Chair. Actually, um, there were three, um, three resolutions at that time. There was two of Manila King Fuel Court that was filed and another one was Court King. So apparently, at the begin the the begin uh, evaluation, instead of parking and the nating uh, nating uh, zoning, ang nilagay nila Manila King Fuel instead of parking. So para so that the records would actually be clear that actually the Sahuyo Station is run under by Court King, but not for that not Manila King, which was a uh, for, it was Manila King was for the two, not for this one. So, okay. po ng so I think um, let this be a lesson to all the councillors, as well as to all our legislative staff. No, um, let us be more vigilant, especially when dealing with um, papers like this. Yung mga um, ang tawag to evaluation, evaluations, because. Um, we cannot be sure kung tama din yung naipapasa sa atin. So sa mga legis po, uh, please read <laughs> please read up the evaluation as well. Kasi like ito, napasa na only to find out na mali pala yung name na nakalagay sa evaluation. So let this serve a lesson to everyone to be more careful. Yes, without further discussion, I will terminate the period of discussion. Okay, there is a motion to terminate the period of discussion to be seconded. Yes. The period of amendments. The period of amendments is so good, that's what I understand. The only that we include on the last question was all the issues of the session. Amendments carried, any more amendments? Having no further amendments, I will terminate the period of amendments. There is a motion to terminate the period of amendments. Should we second that? Now, may I move for the final point for the proposal of the amendment to CC-730? There is a motion to approve PR 22 CC-730. Julie, Sir Ben, Ben, and here, no objection. It is now approved under this committee. Thank you very much.